finish prayer. That is why we are serving you. That is why we are worshiping you. I pray testimony shall abound the more in the mighty name of Jesus. We shall have testimony even now in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for the because you know your answer our prayers. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are here to come and pray.
in your mercy, please give attention to my case this morning. In your mercy, pay attention to my case this morning. In your mercy, set me my case this morning. In your mercy, set me my case this morning. In your mercy, set me my case this morning. I have come here to set me. Set me my case. Set me my case. Oh, 
glory of this ministry shall not end. Every power waiting to see the downfall of this ministry. Children when they are going through a problem. 
So therefore, God himself that we have pity on those that fear him. And it's very clear. God is saying that we have pity on those that fear him. What does it mean to fear God? It means that you reference him. You obey him. You know him and you are honoring him. He said, those that fear him, he will have pity on them. He will have pity on those that fear him. And anyone that fear him, he will have pity on them. So therefore, Many of us that are here, many of us are here, do you fear God? It's only when you fear me, you will have mercy on you, you will have pity on you. That's what we are saying in his way every day. Then I say, Father, pity his son or his daughter, the Lord will pity those that fear him. Yeah, the Lord will pity those that fear him. And when God pity you, He shows that when you pray, He will answer you. Before you call Him, He will hear you. Why? Because you fear Him. So the condition for God's blessing, the condition for God's mercy is fear of God in one's life. So therefore, if you fear God, God will hear you when you call upon Him. He said, as the Father has pitied his children, so I, the Lord, will have pity on those that fear me. If you fear God, you do what God wants, you do what God likes, and you don't have fear God. Everything he tells you, you will do accordingly. If he tells you, do this or do that, that is actually what you will do because you fear me. If you want to claim what you claim that you fear God, then you will do exactly as He has told you. He said, I will have pity on those that fear me. In verse 17, He said, but, but the mercy of God is from everlasting to everlasting. Upon them that fear me and his righteousness unto his children's children. Not 
I pray. 